this cut limps back towards all of you and just uh, profusely thank you for ending the, the crowd. Thank you, Kaiser. I'm almost lost. Well, I have my other ear, but this ear is, is gone. But <laughs> I still have my life. The knights just uh, came back and then just says, Well fight. Well fought. Well, but it's not empty. Okay, what do you do now? Is there anything of value in my room? Uh, no. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I'll just get out. <laughs> it's a commoner's quarter. Who knows? They have I coins, think probably. Things of value is... is yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, so, so I, I'm going to investigate the... You know what? What happened to the cleric? Is he... Is the body still there? Or disintegrated? Yeah, he's, he's still... Well, he's still there. Still What's left of him? Okay, I'm going to investigate the body and whatnot. Okay. Roll yeah. investigation. Then. investigation. I'm, I'm going to do the same as well. Because I'm going to take that. Okay. Both of you, roll investigation. 17. Wait, I want to join. Huh? No, I want to join. I want to join the investigation. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, nobody wants to talk to the knights? <laughs> like what? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I guess. The knights are looking at these people. Suddenly running. Hell bent. Headlong into... Uh, at the body of that. Mm-hmm. Investigation, investigation. Okay. So, Carl, Leona, and where's Chen Chen? Okay, Chen Chen. Camille. Camille's investigating from the roof. Wow. <laughs> uh, Red Shadow is chilling on the roof. <laughs> looking cool. Oh, net 20. Nice. Uh, holy crap. <laughs> Chen Chen. It's running. Well, so that, okay. So, well, he can do forensic. <laughs> All right. Okay, cool. Uh, the cause of death, okay. <laughs> According to Chen Chen, the cause of death is an eldritch blast straight to, to the, the head. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's a face smash eldritch blast. All right. Um, you guys notice the, the similar parchment from Joffrey about raising Havoc okay. and let loose the dogs of war. Alright. All right, all right, all right. And mm-hmm. one more thing. The High Priest has failed us all. High Priest Boris? Mm-hmm. That's the additional note. That's interesting. Um, who Who's reading the note? Chen Chen, I guess. Chen Chen. Okay. Ooh. I... I am going to check the body if there's anything of value. Alright. Yeah, Where's... I'm going to do... Yeah, I'm going to look for clues. So... Clues? Okay. I do first or yeah. does Kami, Carl do first? Okay, yeah. uh, Gus is is intent on finding the clues and he did the forensic investigation and he found the note. Mm-hmm. Carl, what you're looking for? Oh, additional clues, I guess. Additional what... clues. Uh, you notice uh, uh, just a similar necklace uh, that you have found before. Oh, check it out. It is... Interesting. It doesn't seem to be locally made. Wait, isn't that the necklace with Hugh on, on the monster or the mama monster? I don't know. It, does it does it look similar? Inve- it looks similar from your <coughs> investigation. Holy mm. shit. I don't know. Mm. I haven't seen that All before. Right. Uh, mm. we, we need to ask our friend coming to visit. <laughs> Alright. And Leona. What do I get? Who? Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, Leona, you are doing this to the two, right? Uh, what? No, the no, two no. Investigators? No, no, no. The dead body. 
Oh, the dead body is like I'm thinking. Ah, the dead body is investigating. Yeah, like you, just, you, 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 like you I'm, found about six gold coins. Nice. That's quite rich. Yeah, but right. it's a different kind of of uh gold coins. Okay. Um. It's hexagonal. Hexagonal. Uh, no, it, it seems to be like the the ones that you have. Well, it, it it's not local to the 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 south coast. Uh, let's see if I have if not inside um uh, history. Would that work? Okay, rural history. Uh, Nineteen. Okay. Your travels and pensions for reading books and geography of the world, the known world of Ferran, you see, you notice this is something that is originating from Karatur. So um, after getting the gold coins, I do the coin finger thing and I show the guys. Um, you guys know what this is? Showing the Karatu coins. Oh, shoot. Not that coin. So, I'm guessing it's... that... Yeah. Felix told me about this. Okay. Okay. <sighs> let's, okay. Head, let's head to the knights. I mean, uh, they're going to be confused. Yeah, we're going to keep it as evidence, I guess. Yeah. You're so into the show commander, I think. So, yeah. Uh, I, <laughs> at least I head to the, <laughs> uh, to the knights. I think we yeah, all the do. The knights will talk. What are uh, talking among themselves? I try to you no know, calm the guts now. I guess I thought it was already the calm. Guts, I, I, yeah, it's already calm. It's just nursing his wounds. Yeah. Uh, so I try to help him with his wounds. I guess. Right. Yeah. So um, I hit to one of them and um, just say thanks for the backup, guys. Like. We we could have done it without you guys. The marshal orders us to help when needed, when necessary. Yeah, wish things could have turned. Yeah, the the other night says, "I'm just here for backup." Yeah, wish things could have turned out differently, but it seems that things are not great. By the way, do you guys know what this is? I show one of the character coins to them. We can neither confirm or deny that we know anything of that. <laughs> okay. With that, I uh, start off hand the coins away. Just hide it away. All right. All right. Cool, 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 cool. Um, you, you guys are great. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks a lot. I hate to come right. here. Whisper to him. <laughs> No, no, you know what? I'm I'm just gonna hit here and then message to uh Carl. I don't trust these guys. Okay. So uh <laughs> the dead crowds are mostly made up of poor people, uh poor folks or the common folks. And most of them are singed bloodied Dirty, uh, missing arms, ears, uh, heads, of course. And most of them does not have much of a value. And if any, there's anything <laughs> of value on their bodies, are uh, singe or burnt. Do they have any of those old gold coins that you found? It's quite a number of people that you went through. N- number of dead bodies. It's a grisly task going through all of them. And your three of you, your clothes are soaked with the grime and oil that emanates from the dead bodies of the people. They are burned. So some of them emanates, uh, have oil coming out from that wounds. But it's nothing of value that you found. Oh, no, I stay clean. Mm. Now we want to stay clean. <laughs> Wait, you, you you don't you don't join the search. What what are you doing? Oh, Mo- 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 you have oh yeah. Oh, press, press the G- <laughs> Please. 
Tenshin is so intent or I think he he missed his calling as a forensic investigator. <laughs> he, he, he did all this. Oh, missing head. Cause of death, to, missing, missing head. To be honest, uh, he did do well in the caves below. <laughs> okay. So far, so there's no nothing. Nothing. Uh, nothing okay. of value. Uh, it's not what, what, what nothing of value. It's just like sometimes church give up money or give up coin or give up parchment like yeah, paper. Yes. yes. This crowd seems to be just uh, you do not find anything of interest or anything of worth. Uh, is, is, except a lot of deep bodies and appendages or decapitated fingers, hands. Oh, not, man, my fault. Can... not my fault. Uh, 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 I'm going to cast message to Carl. Sorry, uh, yeah, Carl, and tell him let's head to Lelenville now. Like, I don't trust these knights. Okay, I look at you. I'm like, not. Oh. And with that, I'm going to head uh... to uh, Lelenville first. Yay! Tell, tell, tell the guard something to take care of the take care of the everyone. I don't think what so. That's their job. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. But 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 anyway, Asen Asen come, so he they're probably. Are you sure it's Lenivia? I'm here to like. But anywho, yeah, right. let's head to Lenivia. Okay. You make your way to the barracks, well, usually where you find Lenivers. And except Lenivers is on the drill field himself. Oh, that's going to be fun. <clears throat> All right. Um, as we head to the drill field and we see Lenivers, I motion to Carl to go there first while I'll take a 10 feet um, distance from them. Uh, yeah, I, I, ask him, I ask him to hand over... One of the coins, coins yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll palm you a coin. I ask for more. Hmm? Okay. Lenovo is there. Go to Lenivel, I guess, and report to him what happened. And then I show him the coin as well as the. It seems to match the one that we got from the ghost. Yeah. Mama ghost. So, um, as uh, I'm at a file, like 30 feet away from them, and I'm messaging Carl, telling Len, asking Lenivia, yeah, I mean, I'm telling Carl to ask Lenivia if he sent back up or not. Alright. What are you going to you, are you going to, to ask that? I going to ask ask her to come. Like, just just get up here. <laughs> just, just, just come up. I'll just tell him he got a lot of explaining to do later on. This is going to be very fun. So just get up. I do. I do a curtsy. Just get up, Yona. Uh I go to the interview, I curtsy. Hello. My name is Leona, a good friend of Felix. You may have known him. Yes. A fellow paladin of Tear. Yep. He's very dedicated to the cause. A bit too freaky if you ask me. Well, Matt, I think... Have we met before? I doubt it. This would be our first time. But, anywho, uh, did you send backup to cause Ellie? Backup? The guards? Yes, I, the I knights. I can only spare guards. You didn't send any knights? knights? What knights? What knights? Hmm. Well, um, there was an inciting mob with... Uh, there's a mob 
uh, that's been uh, controlled or being manipulated by one of the clerics. And uh, it the was... Clerics? Are you saying the clerics of Lathander are inciting mobs? Yes, the one, well, the same message that you got that tells the people to go crazy. And we also got another letter saying that uh, the high priest has failed them. Show me. I motion to... Show him. Yeah. Chen Chen, is he Chen Chen showing the the letter? Yep. Who is this Joffrey then? And on top of that, I the, found the, the, sorry. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, on top of that, I found Con this. I showed him the coin from Kartur. More of these coins, yes, it is from Kartur. On top. <laughs> Seems to have a lot of this flying around or laying around. True. And when I asked the knights, they seem to decline answering. And since you didn't send them, I'm guessing your buddy sent them to us? Role perception. All four of you. Is this a group perception or...? Yeah, all four of you just roll perception. Wait. Oh. <clears throat> 18. Waiting for Carl's reception. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Not bad. Okay. Not bad. All four of you notice Leniva sucking his breath. Seems to be holding his temper back in check. Hmm. Oh, did we hit a uh, did we hit a spot? Mm, okay. I uh, and then and then almost as quickly see he just come he tried to calmly say I'll talk to the marshal on this. About what? Sending the backup, the knights, or not knowing about the coins? He has assured me he and his men will not enter the town without my leave and I have never given them any any invitation or permission to come into town. If that's the case well I uh, fudge. Uh let's just say that you guys are down by four guards and one is badly injured, missing an ear. Oh god, I wish you'd talk to him. You know what? I'm going to see how he's doing. Um, guys, clean up here. And with that, I'm going to go back to Clawhaley and see the cart. Okay. So, what is the three of you doing? Leona just left you to that <laughs> immediately. Wow. <laughs> Lenevo just in a half just stood up and just went towards the front gates. Shall we go for a drink, guys? I don't think we're mm. done yet. Did, did Lenevo leave us already? Yes, he left. He mounted on his horse and galloped towards the the front gate. Okay, now I'm running. Um, he's not galloping, he's charging. He's charging. <laughs> Double time it. <laughs> wow, it's best. If you can you imagine. Will see, witness the drama. Get some popcorn. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I want to see the drama. Let's go. 
Oh, nobody wants to back me up. <laughs> Shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Huh? <laughs> back you up, do what? You didn't tell us anything, so we're just gonna follow the name. We go to the drama. I'm. I have a Korean drama age. <laughs> I, I want to see the. I want to see the drama. Yeah. So let's go. Let's go, man. Yeah, let's go. Drama let's gang. Go. Drama. <laughs> okay, so Leona is going to cause Ellie alone. Uh, the three of you uh, wants to see drama. So you are just. You see Lenovo charging ahead, in at full throttle, and you are what running or jogging? Yeah, in behind. That shit. Right, right. Try. You are... Damn it! We don't have. Damn it! We don't have a horse. No, you dash. You dash. Sixty feet. Sixty feet. Right. <laughs> okay. All right. So you dash towards that as, as try as you might. You know you cannot out outrun or outmatch a horse at full gallop. <laughs> That's right. As long as, long as we can still catch the drama, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Just in a flash, the Lenovo is out of your sight. Okay, let's go towards that while they are rushing towards the drama. Mm-hmm. Uh, Leona is heading towards Cosby. Hey, Ali. boss. Uh, riding horses in, in the playbook is 60 feet. Ah, 60 feet, but also. if you're dashing, it's 120. Yeah. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> yeah. you, can, I... you, can, you can run uh, the same as a horse that's uh, traveling, galloping or something. But if it's charging, it's dashing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, if it's me right now, uh, I'm uh-huh. going to go as close as possible and not get my attention noticed as I peek right. around Cloth Alley to see the situation. Like, are the knights still there? Is the guard still alive? I- I'll do stealth. Um... I'll do stealth. Okay, roll stealth, please. 18. All right. You blend your way into the crowd, the environment, the surroundings as best as you can. And you took a peek from Horseway at the edge of the building into Cloth Alley. Hmm. Do I notice anything? Like it's the body. The dead bodies are the dead bodies are there, just as you left it. And the guard, is he still there, recovering? You notice another dead body. <sighs> that is not there before. I take oh. a look at. I take a look around at my surroundings. Uh, perception, I think. Perception, please. Twenty one. The guard said. Uh, Cloth Alley is at the scene of a big battle or a lot of um, carnage, so to speak. People are not going there. People are trying to avoid that and trying to, to make themselves scarce. There's only dead bodies lying around the, the streets. Okay, including one new body there, right? Yes. Do I see the two knights? No. I'll head to the body and check the body. All right. Uh, the body is a the body of a guard that's missing an ear. Oh, Fuck! No. Knew this would happen. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Uh, with that, I'll sneak back to the drill field where I last saw an interview. <laughs> okay. So you went there, you sneaking, uh, cautiously making your way there. Uh, the drill field is empty. Are there any other... No one is there. No no, no other guards or anything. Like, it's empty. Totally empty. Well, there are guards or people just uh, trying to get out of here with uh, their weapons... I, in and out of the, the barracks. I, I'll go up to 1% and ask, um, Hey, um, where's Lanivir? Uh, he was here a moment ago. Oh, Milot just went galloping all of a sudden. There are, I think there are four people who met him. They, they started talking and then just Lanivir just jumped onto his horse and galloped. 
towards the front gate. And then mm. three of them try to run and try to overtake the horse or something. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's just that's just stupid, man. Thanks. And thanks. then he was just. <laughs> So, so then his, his knees. So then if it was uh, going to the gate. It was comical. <laughs> I think uh, so. Well, as long as it's not here, you cannot match his temper when he's like that. Oh, true, true. Anyway, um, good day, good day. And I'll head <laughs> to the, well, uh, gates then. All right. So you're heading towards that. Okay. Mm. Three of you who are running at full speed, uh, By the time you arrive at the front gate, you do not see Lenovo anywhere. Here. So it's Chen Chen, Carl, and Camille. Then, would we see any track? Then? Well, there's a lots of track. This is a front gate. There are lots of tracks uh, remember, coming and going. Yeah, but remember the the small one. There's only a few horses, right? Very, very, very few horses move. Yes. Yeah. So you know. Uh, can you roll survival then? How long does this take me to arrive there? <laughs> oh, it will take you about 20 minutes. All right. Let's see how they uh they fare. Yes, I can. Huh? I don't know if survival. They were at full dash, so they they went at ten minutes. But then again, you were we were there, so you're about half an hour away from them. Right. <laughs> about that. Let's see how how they how long they spend time over there. Because if I can arrive there before, they. <laughs> <laughs> okay, survival. All right, all right, Carl. You notice a fresh set of horse, uh, tracks, going out of the gate. Let's go, right? Let's go, let's go. Yeah, but the track sort of, uh, because the 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 gates and the bridge is made of stone, yeah. uh, the track sort of disappeared. All right. Okay. Guess okay. Guess. Guys, I I think I think he went to the camp. Okay. So you estimated you were there about ten to fifteen minutes. Uh. After Lenovo went through there, about that time, he was at at full speed. Okay, so do you go outside? Yeah, let's go. Okay, come here, Chen Chen. Let's go. Drama time. Bring popcorn. Mining illusion. Pop popcorn. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> okay. As you went out of the gate, the the guards just. Salute to you, and let you pass. But they are also okay. One thing that you also notice is very you do not need to have any possession. They also seem to be ignoring the people inside. They are looking outside of the gates, as if they are watching something. <laughs> drama, drama, drama. And then they were looking in that. There are more guards inside than outside. All of them are looking outside of the gate. Oh boy. Okay. As you exit, as you go past the the guards and also the the gates, you notice at the caravan grounds two mounted people, two mounted persons, both in full armor. Are they one going... is one is motioning and pointing towards the other, as if. Saying something, admonishing the other guy. The one admonishing and angrily pointing is Lanniver. He he seems to be saying something or gesturing angrily at the marshal. The marshal just stays on his horse, almost unmoving. Can I can I use my drone to hear get get a Clear, clear image and also the sound. All right, you set your drone. Your drone pun ada ada juga kan, ada speed juga kan. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. One. Okay. As soon as your drone uh 
almost reached to Lenever. It seems like he seems to have some parting words. It is almost like he has done saying something and then through your drone you can hear this. Be sure you keep track of your men. Keep them in check, keep them in line. And then he turned his horse around and he galloped full throttle back into the the gates of Daggerford. Uh, Dag uh, yes. Daggerford, alright. Yep. So I'm guessing I'm not to the gates yet then. <laughs> no, you are still here. <laughs> About right. So I see him pass by like, what the fuck? No, no, no. First, okay, the the three people are at the gates in full mm -hmm. view. Then Lariver just gallop, gallop, gallop. Then he stopped. What are you doing here? Breaking oh, we up. wanted to go get a drink. Breaking up, sir. Drink? What drinks? There's nothing outside except for the refugees. And those bastards. We just want to back you up. Just in case anything gets... Uh, nice. Out and dirty. Yeah, just in case it gets bad. Come to my office. And then with that, he 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 put his horse on the canter. And then going through this, and then he put it at full gallop. And now, the direction of his office. Passing by, I see this motherfucker. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> He just galloped past you. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to go All to right, his office drink. then. Yeah, I'm just going to go to his office then. Okay. <laughs> Motherfucker. You're trying to hmm. fight that. So, the three of you, are you getting a drink or are you following uh, Lanivus' instruction to go to his office? Let's go to his office. Okay. But walk in this this time walking. Oh, yeah, yeah, you are. This time walking. <laughs> Walking back, we're not running. <laughs> not running. Okay, bye. Hi, come here, come here, let's go. <laughs> so, yeah, takes a while, and I think I'm the one to first to arrive. Okay. <laughs> yep, yep. So, finally, you. <laughs> it took a while, I think a good 15 minutes at the. A leisurely pace, at least to recover all the the stamina that you spent <laughs> riding around. So yeah, um, I arrive. I say, and everyone wants to see us or me, and I go up. Then, all right. Knock on the door, and wait for permission to enter. Okay, uh, can you roll perception when you are outside the door? Alright, give me a second. Perception! Go! That took a while. Hmm, to that. 16. Okay, 16. Okay, from inside, you can hear angry voices uh, cursing and something that seems to be banged on the table hard and you are trying to eavesdrop on the door mm -hmm. and then you can hear something suddenly thud at the door Ooh. Ooh. Um, what kind of thud <laughs> alright um, it seems like something has been thrown at uh, the door Um, I knock again and see if sorry no I the first time I didn't knock yes now I I now I yes, knock and see know. if uh I can come in. Okay. See? Oh come in. Oh come in. Okay. Okay. Good. By the time you knock, uh, 
I think the the rest of the party has arrived. They they are just on uh, at the bottom of the stairs. You are up there. Mm-hmm. You're just knocking, and they are just uh there. Mm-hmm. And then from inside, come in. All right. Uh, I hid in. I I don't really notice them. <laughs> okay. I so open the by door. By the time you you mm-hmm. enter, mm-hmm. the first thing that you saw, his room, his office is a bit all over the place, as if. Things are being thrown. The, the I think this is the first time you enter his office. Mm-hmm. You you do not know the condition of his office before that. Mm-hmm. But by the time you 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 just notice it's untidy. Mm. Normal. Okay. So for the rest of them, from Carl to Camille and also Chen Chen, you have been in his office many times before. You notice this is something that is uh, it's not. The way his office is usually organized, this is something that has been like people going r- amok. Things were being thrown, and as you close the door, behind the door is a dagger Ooh. <laughs> that has been lodged onto the door. Okay. Okay. So yeah. Uh, then Lenebo says, "Good, good, good." I'm a man of my word. I have promised a, re- a reward for your assistance. Yeah, thank you very much. But here's the thing: um, before you give us any compensation, we we just need to, well, well, I personally need to tell you what I have discovered. Remember when we told you that this one guard, one one surviving guard, you don't have any now. Seems that he was. Well, is he is he dead from his wounds? Funny enough, no. Um, our uh, our party healed him, so he was stabilized. But it seems that he was murdered by. Oh, did your party heal him? Yeah. And here's the thing. I... Really, did your party really heal him? <laughs> yeah, Camille did a healing on. Sorry, Carl did healing on. The guard, not sure what he did. Did you? Energy. What is it? Yes, that's just energy. Uh, so yeah. So, yeah. yeah. There was one of the first thing that uh, happened when we, when when I hit to the two knights. Did he? Yes. Did he energy? No. He did not roll anything. Eh? He did not roll and he did not oh. No, I did not roll. I did not roll. I just saw him with a wound actually. Well, at least you... <laughs> yeah, I mean, at least that. So, uh, anywho, continuing on. Um, alright, alright, go on, going on. I noticed he was cut and whatnot and that doesn't seem right i feel like he was murdered by the two knights and like i mentioned before the knights seem sketch do you know anything about these coins from Kartur? This coins doesn't come easy. I know that. By by right, it should not even exist outside of the empire. I know that from experience. And when Felix told me that he had a few on him, that was not something that we take lightly in our line of work. This is something that it should not be existing outside of the empire. And you... He mentioned to the three of the midnight hunters that is familiar to him. You guys have reported this before, right? And there's more and more of this coin around. Felix didn't tell Fine. me. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. What? Right. Uh, continue. And also, it seems to be very interesting that 
the acolytes have the same uh, medallion necklace that we collected from the ghost mama. They have the same exact medallion. Show me. Okay, it must be early, early, right? They already show him the early one. But you know, just show it again. Eh? So, okay, you, you show both necklaces, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. The one that we identified and the one that we did not identify yet. Leave this with me. Uh, I have to consult somebody on this. It looks Karatur made. Hmm. Talking about Karatur. Can we, can we have the one that we... Uh, we got earlier from the ghost mama. I need both to have it consulted. Uh, oh, fine. Talking about Kartur, the first batch of coins I... that Felix got, where did he got them from? What do you mean, the first batch? Yeah. That Felix showed to me? Yes. It seems to be originating from another case here. Seems to be a lot of that going around. Any specific about the case that you can share with me? I think you should consult with them. They are the one who reported this to me. Hmm. All right. Hmm. So are you ready to receive what I promise you? Sure. Oh, yeah. 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 I don't mind. Yeah. Can I take a look around the room? Like, I just want to uh, see. No. No, I mean, like, for GM. Like, uh, to GM. I want to... Okay. Uh, you okay. Roll, roll. What, what do you want to roll? You want to roll perception or investigate? Uh, perception, then. Investigate. It is... Yes, perception. Perception is just looking. Yes, nothing. Right. I, I, the room uh, is too messy. Much. The room is too messy. Right. <laughs> Yes, it is. Too messy. So, yeah. Um, and, okay. Uh, can call Camille and Chen Chen. Roll perception also. Okay. Uh, can I just roll a D10? Because my perception is just... <laughs> what? Is nah, minus? Roll perception. <laughs> so you might get lucky. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Then. That's not for me. Yes. Okay, Chen Chen is very perceptive. Yeah. Right. I want to say something here. Uh, inside the door, Inside the <laughs> uh, Okay. Chen Chen and inside. Okay. You, you notice a throwing axe lodged onto the window sill. Oh. The back of his room. Yeah. Mm. That's interesting. Too bad I didn't see it. <laughs> yep. Yeah, somebody has thrown a, a throwing axe <laughs> at the, the the window area and one of the seal uh, at the 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 window seal got hit and it lodged there. Mm. Oh wow! Is it an attack? Hmm. Uh, okay, I, I didn't see it, so can't. Your inside, so it, it is from, it is thrown, in almost like in a rage. Uh. All right, so yeah, we with that we just wait for rewards, I guess, like he promised. All right, he took out uh from. Seems to be that like uh, something that he put under his desk. It seems like uh, a box, a uh, quite a big box, and it's a long box. It's a big long box, and he put onto his table. He opened it, and inside there, there are five items. Hmm. One is a cloak, one is a rapier, 
Hmm. One is a mace, hmm. one is a dagger, and one is a long sword. Oh. <laughs> ah, yes. Hmm. Okay. Oh, wow. I have oh, a good well, feeling of it. <laughs> this is something that I have collected from all my travels and adventures before. Before I became the commander of the guard of this town. Can I do a history I think check Serve you young adventurers. Yes, you were saying? I don't think awesome. Um, mm. well, wow. Do they look magical, DM? They seem to be in good condition. Mm, I'll take up the cloak, I guess. Uh, okay. if you take, take your pick, I'll, I'll take the cloak, pick up the rapier then. Can I identify everything? In front of him? Uh, is he giving us everything? Yes. Ah, uh, we can take our time. Yeah. Thank you, kind sir. Uh, I asked him, what, what's, what is this cloak? You don't want it? No, what is it? It is something that I cannot use. Hmm. Hmm. I'll try and put it on. All right. You you feel handsome. Mm. <laughs> um, as I pick up the rapier, I give it a twirl bit, and I away from people. I do a plunging attack. Shoot. Hmm. This feels fine. Well, it, yeah, it is a well balanced rapier. It seems to be well made. You put it uh on your fing two fingers at the 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 center, the balance between the the handle and the blade. It's really well balanced. Wow, you weren't kidding when you say you collected a lot of good stuff. I go for the dagger. Okay. I shift the rapier, and all right. I. Thank Lenny Vier. And okay. yeah, um uh, on a personal note, I need to be R B. Um so my character will be on autopilot. Okay. <laughs> uh, BRB by full okay. break. Sorry. Alright. Uh, you're not taking anything? Mm -hmm. Maybe I'm I go for take uh, Maybe you want a mace, yeah. huh? The mace seems to be useful. Technically, I have a mace already. So double could be, a, could be a magic. It's okay. I can take everything for you. No worries. <laughs> yeah, I will identify everything later. Ah, uh, yeah. I think I just pass everything to uh, like uh Camille because I yeah because of, mm -hmm. all right. So some of you have have had your pick, and just two items were being held by Camille. Hopefully he doesn't run away with it. <laughs> mm, All right. The mace, the dagger, the long sword. Yep. Okay. Yeah, we thank we thank you, Olivia, for his uh, generous um, gift. Oh, one more thing. Take this also. He he put a uh, another small box. It's a smaller box on the table. Okay. Let's see. take the box. Open it. And we take the box or is it like he's opening the box for us? No, he just put the box there. Yeah, we take uh, the box and open it. Alright. It's a seven inch box. Nah, it, it's a small, it seems like like the size of a jewelry box. Uh, okay. Do you open it? Yep, yep. I'm going to open it. Okay, you open it. Is by your guesstimate, it's about 200 gold coins inside there. <laughs> Hello, what did I miss? 200 gold coins. Each? Nothing much, just 200 gold coins. Total. 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 Okay. So what did I miss actually after right. getting the gifts? Uh, you, you missed Carl taking the cloak. 
Uh, mm-hmm. You took oh. the rapier. Uh, mm-hmm. Camille is taking the dagger, and also and the mace and the long sword. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Because no one is taking it yet. Oh wait. So there's four. Oh yeah. So one is going to shadow. So ah, I see. I have a strong feeling that we are going to rearrange those things for a bit later on. <laughs> yeah. Right, David. Yeah. And 200 gold coins for the group. Yeah, so... Uh, 50 each. Around 40 each. 40? 50 each. 40, 40. 40. We, we don't forget Shadow. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. We, we should give Shadow the gold. Alright. Cool, cool. So, All right. uh, are we still okay, in the office? Nothing more. Right. Leave. Oh, one more thing. Alright, thank you, sir. One more thing. Ensure your window is locked. Oh, there may be Why? some bur- some. I noticed something that seems to disturb me. Things were not in place as it was before. Really now, burglary at this moment. Uh, if you don't mind me, how did they enter? Like through the window? You seem to have good guesses for some reason. Well, Do you know anything? Well, in my line of work, you have to do a lot of assumptions. If you don't mind me, I'm going to check the windowsill for a bit. And I walk to the windowsill and I investigate, see if I can do shit here. Alright, roll investigation. Nope! The X bothers me. Hmm, right. so... <laughs> this X... Was it thrown at the Luna. perpetrator? No, you're, not, you're, you're rolling the wrong one. That's inside, oh, not investigation. Inside. Ah, yes, okay. Investigation. Oh, that one. Alright, cool. My bad. <laughs> ah, yes. Better, 13. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Inside on the windowsill. Hmm, it's made of wood. <laughs> it's made of wood. <laughs> and then the anyway says, stay away from there. You, you, do not, you will not find anything. Before this, I noticed no on the window sill mm-hmm. and a track I never left my window open hmm that's peculiar well if you want us to check it is around close. it is close but how can a closed window have snow inside it? it means it has been open and left open for some time to, for the snow to gather that's on the window true. sill if you want us to check the back of River Road, we can do so when... Does the guys do patrolling at night? I'm not sure. Felix likes to patrol at night. Like, that's... Or oh, 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 anything of note stolen. Come on, everyone. I'm not going to disclose anything to you. Do your investigation and be gone. All right, then. But is there, is there any more, like, reports, like, from the, like, attack in the poor quarters or anything else? Though? The poor quarters are in disarray. The acolytes have riled people up. If there's anyone, uh, even my guards were being attacked by the townsfolk there. Hmm. If there's any more attacks or anything, no, there's... Maybe not even anyone that is reporting or even my guards are able to enter there safely to do inv- investigation. Alright. Okay. Um, All right. How, how is the Duchess doing? The Duchess is recovering well. Is there any way for us to go and meet her? Mm, yeah, thank you of that. Yes. I think, the I think, I think um, one thing, because of the marshal is outside I want to call a meeting among the councils and the marshal in order to trash everything out you see all of the letters that you have shown to me I will present to the duchess with the marshal as the witness and also as a neutral party to make the assumption I want to present this to accuse the high priest of treason. But there's part in the notes that say that he has failed the group. 
Do you think that the acolytes are acting on their own? It is a possibility. I have thought about that also. It Will feels... you have time to investigate for me? Sure. I mean, I got nothing to do here. <laughs> so this is just another job for me. Yes. So is there... You can any... try to investigate. Yeah, you can try to investigate the burglary in my office. Right. Or you can investigate the acolytes. So they are now usually centered around Water Street. Here's the thing: I pass by the acolytes HQ, and they seem to have white acolytes now. It seems like they're war priests. And the war priests. Yeah. The war priests are the of the officers of the the clergy. Yeah, and they are the one who's protecting the church. I temple. see. Do you think that them knowing that there's an uprising, they've denied access to the normal acolytes? Could that be an option? Or could there be a theory? It can be. Do list your the theories and present them to me. If that's the case, I need to do a bit more investigation. Could you write me a letter for accessing the church? No, that would be so... That would be suspicious. No, I'll I'll figure that, a way in. That that would inside World War Three. Yeah, that that would that would be. You know, I'll try and think of something. I'll try and think of something. But <laughs> if Boris, if, if Master Boris is not uh, not in cahoots in this scene, then were it, have you seen him recently? No. He has been holed up in head in that posh building of his for some time. Not getting, not being able to go in is really troublesome. Mm. Well, I'll come back with tools that I might need later on. But other than that, well, we'll do just basic investigations. Well, that's it for me. Thank you for the rapier and have a good day. With that, I head out. Oh. Uh, Commander Lenever, for the time being, I think we might be staying in the Daggerford Inn. It's here, right? Daggerford Inn. Fine. So, yeah. No? Yeah, so if you have the, any... yeah, even the areas around the dorms are unsafe for now. Yeah, so if you, have any... attacked. if you have anything of note, you can find us there. We'll be, we'll be there, the Daggerford Inn. Very well. <laughs> well have a good day, sir. I have to if, mobilize more men to cordon off the poor quarters. Well, if you need help, you can always look for us. Okay. For sure. Is there anything else? Otherwise, get out of my office. I'm halfway there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're halfway down the stairs already. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Call us there. Yeah. Uh, for the time being, no. What? What? Cannot hear you. Can you? Ooh, Hello? Breaking up, was it? Oh, sorry. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, for, for the time being, I tell, shout to the guys. Guys, I tell the guys, not shout lah. Tell the guys. Uh -huh. uh, the time being, let's go to the Dagger, let's stay at the Dagger Fort Inn first. Uh, right. Because the place might be safe. Mm -hmm. A lot of people. Alright. All right. Yeah. Uh, and, and all of you remember the mess hall at the dorm is quite Icky. Um, icky with the ale, beer, and stuff that you poured onto the poor guy. <laughs> oh, uh, poor guy. Camille, uh, you just also remembered, Camille, for good measure, poured some coffee powder on him also. He is ah. both he is both sober and drunk at the same time. Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so all of you are going to the Daggerford Inn? Yeah, I guess. Uh, yep. DM, what's the time now, actually, in-game? Okay, the time now is about 7 p.m. Mm. 7 p.m. Mm. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. You've been <laughs> running around a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Korean drama. <laughs> um, 
as we head to the Daggerford Inn, I just discussed with the group that, you know, Shadow's missing. He's, we haven't seen him since the incident at the gates. Uh, he's fine. He's sleeping in the shadows. He'll be back. He told me. Uh, we used to it. Okay, I mean... Yeah, I go to the Grand Playhouse sometime, and then I come back. No worries, we all got our business. Alright. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, so, we um, all... So, you are going there? Mm-hmm. Yep, we're yeah. going there. Okay. I'm gonna get a room, and then we're gonna... Let's go. Are we... Okay. Are we gonna share a room together, or how? Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. <laughs> Let's, room okay. uh, Let's be room do, buddies. Do we? Do we? Um, have we arrived at the inn? A bit cheaper. Yeah. Yes. All right. I'm gonna uh, go last to. Last time around is about seven seven twenty. Yeah. I'm okay, going to. Share a room. To... Mm-hmm. Okay, room. Yeah, sure. It's cheaper. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to head to the bartender and say, "Hey, Lionel, how's business?" Well. Business in the food industry, uh, people seem to like my Happy Meals. Ah, the, that concept, people do enjoy it. Nice. Oh, That's good. yeah. Especially the, you know, the the makeshift barracks outside. Mm-hmm. From all the nights, they are so used to their rations. A Happy Meal makes them happy. That's great. That's great. That's great. Um, I was wondering, do you have a room for tonight? Yeah. Uh, how many rooms do you need? Mm, probably two, maybe. I don't know. I mean, I sure, just sure. I just need one for myself. And how's the entertainment for tonight? Uh, entertainment is a bit sparse. You know, the cool and also the troubles. <laughs> <laughs> See, <laughs> I'm getting even cough. Uh, the well, cold Lucky for you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, luckily for you. So what do you need? Well, a room. But how about I pay it in entertainment? I'll be entertainment for tonight. Well, if you're good enough. Well, I've played here before. Mm. Not that impressed, but okay, you can try. Do better this time. <laughs> we'll do, sir. We'll do. And yeah, with that, I book a room and I head out on stage. All right. Uh, let's so, see. So, uh, okay. Camille uh, says identify time. Are you going to identify it first? All the, the items uh, I'm going to watch the performance first. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so. What, you want to be roll or just we just pass time? <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, just pass time. Uh. I think you 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 can have okay lah. Uh, Lionel says okay, he's quite okay with the for the night. He you use your service to pay for that. Yay! Also, I want to try a new instrument that I've kind of made while I was traveling. <laughs> it is called. Wow. It is called a accordion. Ooh. So yeah. <laughs> I play some polka song. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. <laughs> okay. Anything else that you are doing there? Come here. You want to join? Nah, I just want to see how good she is. All right. So, what else oh. do you need? Hmm? Okay, you have two rooms. Two rooms? Uh-huh. Yeah. Identify time. So you'll be identifying all the five yeah. items, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. Five minutes. All right. So, the first item is a cloak of protection. Oh. Oh, nice. Ooh. The second item is a rapier. Plus one. Oh, rapier plus one. Okay, glad it's not a gambler's blade. <laughs> gambler's rapier. Too early lah. 
No, that would dagger, that... <laughs> the, the dagger is is a bit interesting. Uh it's a dagger of poison. Mm-hmm. Oh wow. The maze is a maze plus one. Oh and as similar to the long sword, it is also a long sword plus one. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> nice. It is something that has been in Lenovo's collection. You know he doesn't give this kind of things, trinkets, uh, to people that he that doesn't seem to be worthy to him. So, yeah, are the, are the weapons magical? Pardon? Are the weapons magical? Magic weapons? Uh, if I say plus one, is it magical? Yes, <laughs> it is. <laughs> Some people say, yeah. Some people say GM will say it's plus one, but it's not comfort. <laughs> or like that. All of them are magical. Yes, these plus are magical one. items. Oh, that's cool. Oh wow! Wow, the cloak is nice. Yeah. Yeah, but we'll have to wait and see the whole party what they really need. Up to you guys. Mm. Wow. Okay. So you after that you Sorry. Yep. Hey, oh? Sure. Yeah. Well, uh okay, you guys are su- surprised with what the 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 gifts that were given by Lanever. You know these are not the the normal items that's given nilly willy. Hmm. Hey, DM, can you give the dagger of poison text? I cannot Google one. Dagger of poison? Dagger of venom, got lah. Oh, dagger of venom, sorry. Dagger of venom. Sorry, it, it's called a dagger of venom. Mm, yep, okay. betul. All right. Poison pula. <laughs> well, just be glad it's not the core cut, deep, uh, core cut dagger. <laughs> that one. Ooh, the poison damage. Oh, good. The dagger is really good. Hmm? This is like Baldur's Gateway. <laughs> <laughs> well, kind of. We're close to it, right? Yeah, it's the same world, I guess. Yeah, I mean, if we're close to Baldur's Gate, I think, yeah. Yeah, it's just to the south. <laughs> hmm, see? Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 2d10 poison damage. 2d10 poison damage. Holy shit. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> all right all right so yeah uh, everybody got 40 I guess, I guess, okay. mm-hmm. xp are you guys ready for this yep yep yep, yep. oh yeah yeah it's 2000 xp Ooh. Per yeah. Person. sweet wow level up is it i don't know 2000 was it? Yes. 2000. Level 5 is 6007. Almost. Almost. 5,370. 5, 7, 8,000 more. Because the, the crowd, the, the angry mob is, is something. Mm, yeah. That, that is just scary. Almost, almost. Mm-hmm. But uh, it's just an angry mob. You have not encountered a riot or an uprising. <laughs> yeah, la, not town heroes yet. <laughs> still, not still. Yet, not yet. So, um, we're in one room, right? Right now? Yes. Uh, because of that, you cannot even believe what you have in your hands. Okay, so... After, many, uh, after about, uh, more than a month of... <laughs> well, for these players, la, mm-hmm. especially for uh, Carl... <laughs> uh, okay. But so, still laughing. So yeah, um, as we identify and whatnot, I talk to the group and say, "So guys, what's going to be our plan for tomorrow? Like, what are we going to investigate and so on?" Hmm. Uh, I would like to investigate. Church. Hmm. It's 
the church is one point of contention that we kind of really need to go in. But at the current moment, it seems that nobody is allowed to get in. And that's the hard part. I feel like, yeah, we should, but uh, I don't know. Like, I find it hard to get in. That's true. The church has been quite hard to get in as well. Yep. Wonder whose whose fault is that? <laughs> we all know. <laughs> um, but I wonder. But okay, how about this? Um, tomorrow morning we'll head to the back of the Lenovris office to investigate that break in that happened. Mm, sure. Sure. I I'm gonna guess that we won't find anything, but. At yeah. least it's worth a look. Knowledge. Yeah. Knowledge. Mm-hmm. Hello. Oh. Yep. Shadow fucked up. We don't know. <laughs> oh, Shadow will know. Shadow will know. We don't know. Shadow's not here. So. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Um. All right. So. Uh, Leona looks to Camille and asks, "Can you investigate the Grand Playhouse?" Camille? Camille? Is he not in? What? Yes. <laughs> uh, can you investigate the Grand Play House tomorrow? Of course! I need info oh, on a guy with one ear. I think you guys are familiar with him. Yep. Like, either... I'm not sure. Like, tracking him would be better. Track him and see where he goes on a regular basis. We might need to talk to him and ask him about certain things involving a certain wolf. Alright, track him down. Got it. Other than that, uh, just investigate back off the universe office and that's about it. Mm, technically, we have less, the sword from Aglaron. That one? I What's yeah, that? I don't, I don't know. We, we kind of slay like a crocodile or something in the sewers. So we found his sword. Wait, so the crocodile has a sword? A... Excuse me, what is it? The crocodile has a sword? Of Aglaron. Yeah, yeah, why? Yeah, I mean, like, um, um, Chen, uh, Chen Chen said that they got a sword from a crocodile. So Leona's just like, yeah. wait, what the fuck? A crocodile has a sword? Yeah. Uh, this, is a, this is a long story. All, all righty then. All righty then. Yeah, so I want to investigate that part. Mm. Like, who's like, Must be some connection. And think about it, don't you have the height from the crocodile with you, Leona? No. That was put into evidence. Oh, okay. So Lenevi should Lenevi and his crew should have it. But alright, um here's the plan for tomorrow. We investigate the back. If there's anything we report back to Lenevi on the same minute and we can ask him about this sword. That you get from a cro- that yeah. you got from a crocodile, yeah. Yeah, maybe. Uh, if Lenevi doesn't know anything, maybe we can go to the Smith. Probably, and but see if that. Yeah, probably, but at the same time too, um, he would have known stuff like this. But either or, we'll just ask whoever's available at the time. Mm, yep. True. 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 Anyway, boys, I'm gonna head to my room and. Have a nice sleep. Good night. I walk out and head to my room. Yeah. And lock it. Alright. So we will end our campaign for tonight. Alright. So next week will is election day. Oh yeah. So yes. Yeah. Yeah. Johor. 
Oh, yeah, shit. election and and so there is a chance that we will not be playing. Mm, okay. All right. So hope you guys enjoyed tonight's adventure. Yeah, tonight's adventure was fun. Yeah. Oh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. I still feel bad that we kill a lot of people. Nope, not me. I was taking the cloak, ah, Zuma. Um, honestly speaking, uh, we should just um compile it first and see who really can abuse the ability on those things. Yeah. Like, uh, technically, I should get the technically I should get the dagger because it does work well with my sneak attack. But I don't mind either way. Uh, mm-hmm. the you cloak. Really yeah, why not? Uh, the cloak. Um, I feel like should go to Chen Chen because he's the quote unquote tank. Oh shit! <laughs> he doesn't act like a tank. <laughs> eh, but still, uh, his AC is high compared to the rest of us. Is it? Yeah. Strength is minus what? Strength is minus two. It was funny. Dang. I'm a tank, but I'm weak. You're a dexterous tank. <laughs> I'll <laughs> trade the rapier for the dagger. Yeah, but <laughs> I do range anyway. Yeah, you guys sort it out. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, but for now we'll just decide and what because we also need yeah. shadows input on this. <laughs> See, there is a saying: you want to test a party, give them items. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh my god! It's a good thing we didn't get any deck of things. <laughs> That's funny. Oh God! You you could it, and you got what accessory call? Ah, mox. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Yeah. All right. All right. So okay. hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, but then again, uh, I think it, it's a worthy experience because yeah, I designed the 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 mob to be something like that. You see, the the mob is quite scary. Yeah, the attack. Yeah, I mean, um, honestly speaking, I thought that after damaging them a bit, we could have, well, I could have slipped them, but nah, like, not sure what you did, but they weren't sleeping. I think, I think mobs are meant to sleep. Chum. I mean, depends on what the GM says, but yeah, um, it was really something else. <laughs> we don't have a wizard for me and no, no. Fireball. no, no. Well, you do get you you did get a fireball kind of quote unquote spell. Shatter, yeah, shatter. Nah, Molotov cocktail, baby. One d four, only right? One d no, one d eight, and then after that, uh, they need to do a on their on the start of their turn, they need to do another one d, uh, eight. For how many rounds the fire lasts? So yeah. Can, roll, uh, can all of you except for Camille roll perception? Oh no! Wait, um, I'm not in the room. Okay, sure. Um, can all of you except for Camille and Leona uh, roll perception? <laughs> I'm just going to roll for fun. <laughs> uh, perception. Yep. Okay, Carl. Okay. Ooh, All right. Oh. Carl is inside the room as you are talking, and I think Leona is uh, at the next room. Mm-hmm. You can hear somebody. Uh, it seems like somebody is testing out sword or maze, <laughs> trying to switch, <laughs> swinging attack. <laughs> <laughs> this and that, Carl. You 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 notice Camille is just testing out weapons left and right with inside the room. Oh, he... uh, I'll just lie down a bit. <laughs> oh, are, are they getting hit? Are they getting hit? <laughs> uh, DM is Felix's uh long sword and great sword look magical. No. Um, well, he's not there anymore. Uh, he's not there with you. Oh, I have his weapon. They're not. They're not. They're just basic as um, great sword and okay. long sword. It's not. Yeah, it's not. 
We will make a grave with the weapon. Yeah. <coughs> so. <laughs> oh boy. I wonder so if that's random you, or not. You, if you want to rest, you better calm Camille down before he tests <laughs> and, and fumble. Next time, I'll try to have a fumble rule. Or oh. rage fumble or melee fumble. Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> the crow of crow protection. <laughs> oh god. But are you wearing it? <laughs> yeah. Oh god. You you guys are gonna have toilet a fun night. Crow. <laughs> toilet will pakai cloak. Toilet will pakai cloak protection. <laughs> oh boys. Cloak cloak function. Anyway. <laughs>